In this video, I want to answer the question, what is predictive analytics? Predictive analytics is an approach to figuring out what's going to happen in the future. It uses statistical data and modeling to provide probabilistic estimates. We can compare this at one extreme with descriptive analytics, which uses analysis of the data to provide a description of what has already happened or what is happening now. At the other extreme, we can compare it with prescriptive analytics. This is an analytic approach that aims for certainty in determining what decisions we should take to get the results that we want. To do this, it uses things like simulations, mathematical modeling, and machine learning. So, descriptive analytics is, in a relative sense, easy. Modern data and business intelligence tools like Tableau or Power BI gather together huge amounts of data and enable us to analyze them in real time. This allows us to interpret the data to gain a clear description of the events in our organizations. Prescriptive analysis is clearly an end goal. We will always have that desire to gain a measure of certainty in our anticipation of future events. With predictive analytics, we hope to bridge the gap to provide a middle ground between what is relatively easy to do and what is clearly our end goal. So predictive analytics starts with current and historical data and it searches for patterns. The presumption is that if there are patterns that are repeating, then they will repeat again in the future and that will be the basis of our prediction. And if we can make predictions, then we can deploy our project resources to take advantage of the opportunities that might be before us and to prepare for the threats that we may face. This is clearly valuable to us, not just in risk management, but also in planning and in the preparation of business cases. Predictive analytics are widely used in a huge range of industries and professions. These include financial services, marketing and consumer businesses, pharmaceuticals, insurance, and even weather forecasting. Predictive analytics uses sophisticated methodologies from the world of computing and mathematics. Methods like decision trees, regression analysis, and neural networks. So, although predictive analytics is not the same as machine learning, which some people seem to think, it does use machine learning as one of the techniques that help to build up the predictive analytics software. It was recently reported that some predictive analytics tools that use machine learning were able to produce more accurate weather forecasts more quickly and further ahead of the events in the case of extreme weather conditions. Without a doubt, these tools are going to supersede the traditional modeling and data hungry tools that were used and developed in the last 50 years. So what's the role of predictive analytics in project management? The most obvious arena for predictive analytics in the project management domain is project planning. Here, machine learning tools can assimilate data from hundreds, even thousands of project schedules and project outcomes. From this, they can not only produce viable project schedules from the data you provide, but they can also highlight the potential for schedule variances arising from the typical risks that we see. They'll be doing this not by understanding those risks, but by recognizing where historically there have been variances. And of course, if we can collect performance data in real time, then the predictive analytics tools can be updating our project schedules in real time too. But it goes further. 
In the construction sector, for example, there is a strong dependency between the project schedule and the weather. Weather can have a huge impact on project schedules in construction projects. But we've already understood that predictive analytics is not only good at estimating project schedules, but it understands weather patterns. By connecting the two data sources up, predictive analytics can update project schedules in real time on the basis of predicted weather events. The other main arena for predictive analytics in the project management domain at the moment is in risk management. The consulting company Deloitte has a five-stage risk management process that places predictive analytics at its heart. Step one is a pretty standard assessment of the project's complexity and therefore the likely level of risk. Step two involves conducting project interviews with key stakeholders and players and doing a full document review. At step three, we feed all of this information into the software and use predictive analytics to carry out a risk review. At step four, Deloitte analyzes the output from the predictive analytics tool and uses that information to identify potential improvements to the risk controls on the project. And at step five, they report on their findings and make their recommendations. Deloitte claims that its predictive project analytics tools has helped organizations to bring in $120 billion worth of projects to successful and effective outcomes. So without a doubt, Predictive analytics is a rapidly maturing approach that project managers will increasingly find useful in planning our projects, in managing our projects, and in delivering our projects. Please do give this video a like if you've enjoyed it or learned from it. I'll be making loads more great project management videos for you, so please do subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of them. And I look forward to seeing you in the next one.